Oh yeah. Allow me to take that one last time. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, oh, whoa. Oh, this is all I can say at this point. Oh. If we, oh shoot, they broke through. I mean, I killed one of their best men. If we had Griff. Oh, shit. It's over. Like, this looks like shit. Like, what do we do at this point? Oh, man. Like a beast. I am... Oh no! I will not die. Not now. Thank you, my fine men. Oh, that's poor guy. There's no way I can live through all this. I've been stabbed too many times. Gosh, damn! No, not her. She was like the best one in my team. Oh no. Oh no. Can I suck it up? I am from ice. No. Oh. oh. Thank you. I didn't think you would come in at last minute. Let another lord die on my watch. Save yourself. Yeah, I'm dying. You must survive, Asher. For the house. For all of us at Port this day. Now. Oh shoot, damn! Oh. That. That is not good at all. Wait, so what happens? So we lost? There's no way that could be the it of, um. That could be it of episode 6, because. That does not make any sense at all whatsoever. Because then what happens with Garrett? What happens with um, Mira and my family? How are they all dead? I mean, they're not dead, but like what? What happens from here on? I'm going to give a drink to this. Uh. All right, cool. My throat got a little dry at that moment. See? I didn't let them do anything horrible to him. See, if I would have cut out his heart, she would have saw me do all that brutal stuff. This should be the ending already, because I'm on chapter 6, and I think it's only you did the 7 right chapters per episode. I did what I had to do. She was your friend. Was. Goodbye, Cotter. Like, uh, more than anything, I'm happy that Lud is dead. I am happy that that one guy is dead. I wish my character killed um Griff. I swear, he should have just stabbed him when he had him in the corner, even if she stabbed him in the back. Because I knew you couldn't trust Gwen. I know you couldn't trust her. She was for herself. She had no concern for my family. Not one bit. Your arrival has changed everything. Thank you. Even though we've been preparing for it all our lives. Now we don't have much time. We were sent here for a reason. To protect the North Grove. Winter is coming. And we have a role to play in the war to come. Why does everyone say that? Winter is coming. Winter is coming. Stand by and see how's Forrester fall. 
Not while we can still do something about it. It's too late to reach Iron Wrath. It may already be lost. Gregor trusted you for a reason. You know defending House Forester is the right thing to do. You're the one they sent, Garrett. You should be the one to decide. House Forester needs our help. So we'll gather our forces and march south. May the gods guide us and protect us. Because um, I think they could still have a chance of getting the house back. Since Asher's not dead, we just need him to heal. Which is, at this point, almost impossible. But I'm um, living... Uh, what's it? Positive? I'm being positive right now? Optimistic. There we go. I couldn't think of the word. Look, everybody's talking shit. I can hear you guys. I hear you guys fapping over there. Oh, can I move? Oh, no. Wait. Oh, I could move. You let me move right now. Uh, everyone's talking all these bad stuff about me. Say all the dirty thoughts you want to say. I don't care. I don't care. I'm I'm a dead woman anyways. I'm an independent female who don't need no man. No, uh, how mad he is cuz he knows I don't need no man. Bring forth the next prisoner. Wait, what? Oh, me? What is that? Is that like a coupon to Starbucks or something? Better be a damn coupon. Saw what he had in his hand? He had a coupon, guys. Oh wait, what am I doing? Accused of murdering a loyal servant of the king. Accused. Who here bears witness to her crimes. I will speak to them. This woman is a traitor and a murderer. Kill her. She did it. A disgrace to her family Kill name. Her. Mira Forrester. I, I must stand tall because you know what? I'm gonna show him that it doesn't even phase me. King. Even in death, I'm a boss of sorters. If you have final words, I didn't want to kill Tom because there's no way I could sacrifice him. He saved me. Oh, she's there too. Push down to Neil. I gotta put my head right there. Oh, are they gonna show it? I hope they don't show it. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. I don't even know. I'm like, I'm like shaking right now. Oh, damn. At least they didn't show it, but damn. I mean, I know I could have done everything I could to make sure the whole family lives, and I could have. But that's not how I play the game. How I play the game is we go all out. Even in death, our name will be glory, will be innocence, will be tacos and burritos. We ride tonight. I like at this point, I don't know how I feel. It's just like it took so much to get here. But at the same time, at what cost? Did it take for me to accomplish all this in the end? How much sacrifices did it take? I will not let these people die in vain. And that is my sole duty as a warrior of House Forrester. Well, warriors to be exact, because I was practically more than one person. Just throwing that out there. I mean, House Forrester. 
They were nothing but Stark loyalists. And the Starks are dead. Are you listening, Reek? Father wanted to make sure they'd bend the knee. And what do I find? A child lord. Ethan the Wise. With some parasite by his side. As if I'd come to negotiate. <laughs> and I thought, oh, this is going to be fun. Mira was so devoted when we first came to King's Landing. I'm interested in what the hell is going on right now. Huh? Day Cersei dragged her before the throne. Grandmother, I was actually worried for her. But she didn't have any trouble swearing loyalty to Joffrey right in front of me. Then she had the audacity to go behind my back with Tyrion when I'd clearly forbade it. And that day she pushed me to ask Joffrey for help when he ripped my dress. It was bold, I'll give her that. But I can't forgive that she used me. And now, with all that's happened to her, who knows what else Mira was doing without my knowledge. Grandmother, it makes me question if she was ever loyal to me at all. I don't... I don't I understand, like... Myself in Garrett like, why are they showing this? I trust in him, Sam. But I was wrong. He gave me his word that he'd stay true to the vows he'd made in the Godswood. Yet before her day was out, her brother was dead atop the wall. I needed his sword at Craster's. I defended him to Frostfinger. And it cost me. Whatever happened up there, a man of the watch doesn't run away. Who should return then? But another Lord Forrester. Roderick. Back from the twins with balls so shrunken he let Griff Whitehill beat him into the mud in his own yard. Reek, I had to come and see this walking tragedy for myself. But he didn't even have the courage to stab me with my own blade. But then, he jabbed out that fourthborn's eye. I was rather starting to like him. A shame he didn't last longer. Roderick, the savior who couldn't save anyone. Oh, that is There's sad. About Asher Forrester. You would have liked him, Miss Sandai. If she helped me out, we would have won the he war. Cocky, Stupid surely, blonde lady, white haired lady, child. little dwarf, smurfette, looking ass bitch. Asher needed <laughs> I needed to know if he deserved it, so I tested him. And he impressed me. He followed my every command, despite what it cost him with his companion. For that, he earned my help and my respect. I didn't get your help. What are you talking about? I got a stupid pile of gold. Friendship. Respect. Without them, we have nothing. I think, in the end, Mira came to understand that, Grandmother. She could so easily have turned on Sarah to protect herself. But instead, what she did it took grace. If you're fierce enough, you leave King's Landing with your honor intact. Mira proved that. But at so high a cost. I could have told you this story wasn't going to have a happy ending. Roderick dead, his mother dead, his little pile of timber in ruins. I just wish I'd been there to see it. That Bolton bastard let their upstart houses go to war, father. I'm not unfamiliar with these foresters. Stubborn to the end. They were clever, I'll give them that, but far too sentimental. Ruled by emotion when they should have been smart. Instinctive instead of shrewd. She's calling me shrewd? The Starks are dead. The war is over. And they lost. Okay. I fought with instinct and nobility? Damn right I did! Damn right I'm male! Damn right! Kept your integrity but lost Marjorie's favor- Screw her! Submitted to Griff for the sake- Okay, so I think those red ones are bad? I don't know, I- I'm- Like, I don't even understand how this game is going at this point. I mean, I know this is already the end, but- it's just like, it left me with a whole bunch of questions and a whole bunch of confusion that I don't even know. Wait, oh, the game's still continuing? Oh, hell yeah. 
I thought that was the end. What was going on here? Oh yeah, Asher. Huh? Did that, did that guy, oh, he's dead too. Oh, they're gonna finish me off, aren't they? Oh, well, goodbye, Asher. I mean, you know, I respected you. I knew you well. I tried my best to ensure that you lived, but I didn't do that great. You're gonna die out here, aren't you? Asha? What? My lord. How'd you guys find me? We it's this douche again. You're the one that got us all killed. They may have won this battle, but they will not win this war. Oh, now you're all about the war. First he was like, oh, we should bow down to them. And now he wants to fucking get me all killed. Asshole. Oh, she saved my brother? Oh. Oh, this is... Oh, this is actually pretty interesting now. Um... That was a good ending. That was a little good secret to throw out there. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, there's all my stats apparently for this episode. If you guys want to check that out, hold on. Let me go on to the main menu really quick. Cause I like the music in the background. It keeps me um, a little relaxed, calm. Let me skip this. Nobody wants to see this nonsense. Come on, skip the stupid credits. Nobody wants to see the credits. We just want to see the story. This is what we're here for, not for the stupid credits. Okay, cool. All right, guys, so that is the end of Game of Thrones. So now we be episode one, we be episode two, episode three, episode four. I had to burp at the same time. Episode five, episode six, and we are done. I don't know if there's going to be an episode seven or eight, considering the way they left that ending where you can see Ryan's still alive and he looks hungry for battle. Asher's still alive, thanks to, um, uh, what's his name, Reggie and uh, uh, my sister Talia. And then Garrett's bringing his army. So we'll see how that goes from there. I don't even know if it's going to continue. But if they do continue, it's probably going to continue from there. Mira is dead. I mean, I probably could have... Like I said in my video, I probably could have saved everyone and ensured that nobody died. But that wasn't what I was aiming for. <laughs> and um, I just wanted to have an all-assault all war. And I wanted to make it as dramatic as possible and interesting. Because who wants to see people cowering through the whole video? I mean, that's... I mean, if that's what you want to do, that's cool, you know, but I'm pretty sure Game of Thrones is about, like, battles and drama and things like that. I think that's why people are interested in so much. I mean, I wouldn't know because I don't watch Game of Thrones, but I'm pretty sure that's what the fans like about it. So I try to make it um, to what I believe is the idea of Game of Thrones. And it, I have to admit, I liked it. The beginning, I was a little interested in it. Episode 2, I lost interest. Episode 3, I lost interest. Episode 4, I lost interest. Well, except for the end. And then episode 5, I gained interest again. And then episode 6, I really enjoyed it. I just wish they kept the, the flow of being entertained with the game through all 6 episodes. Which, I, like I said, I kind of lost interest around the, the middle. And so we're done with this game. Also, um, I just found out that... I don't know when this video is going to come. It might come up later or it might come out before. I don't know. Um, Batman Telltale Games is coming out pretty soon in a couple of days i am gonna buy it and then we're gonna play it um and then i think the digital version is gonna come out in august and then the cd this version if you wanted to get that one that one's gonna come out in september i wish they came out the same time i don't know why they decided to do it different i wanted to get the disc version but then i would have to wait longer and i want to make the video as soon as i possible because you guys know i love me batman i did a batman playthrough of batman arkham uh night and I know I didn't finish it, and I know I wasn't as good as commentary as I am now because I was still getting used to YouTube at the time. But I really enjoyed the game. I wish I did a better job at commentary, though. But now, I think I'm better at it. I think I'm a little more enthusiastic than before. And also, I'm going to do Wolf Among Us now that I'm done with this game. I'm going to go jump back to um The Walking Dead and finish that one because I know I haven't done it. Uh, Minecraft Story Mode should be coming out now. Access Denied, Episode 7. And then when Episode 8 comes out, We'll do that one and i'm pretty sure they're gonna continue with the minecraft story one because that sells a lot i also heard rumors that there might be the wolf among us 2 maybe a possibility i don't know but if there is i am gonna play the shit out of the game 
But first, like, I need to do the Wolf Among Us for you guys because that was my favorite Telltale game. And uh, oh, also, uh, I know, like, like, I've been saying in my previous videos, I've been lagging to put videos up. It's like I said before, it's an oven in my house over here in California, and I am having a hard time making videos for you guys. I'm sorry about that. I'm truly sorry. I really want to do two videos per day. I like, I feel real bad. Like sometimes I go to work and I'm like, I just put up one video. Why the hell did I do that? I should have put in more work to put another video. And I'm sorry about that. I really want to do two videos per day. As soon as August comes around, I heard it's going to start cooling down. And I will still go back to doing two videos for you guys. And I'm going to do my best to make them a little longer for you guys and a little more entertaining. So, yeah, th there's that. And for comments, I know there's been people who commented on my videos and I have not replied back to you guys. I'm sorry. What's been going on for me is that I wake up super early in the morning and I go out for two to three hours of exercising and then I come back home and then I, I would have cut. I am so tired after that, that I try to do a video for the day and then I fall asleep and I wake up super late. Then I go straight to work. Well, I throw up the, I throw the video to upload for me and then I tell my computer to turn off at a certain time when the video is done uploading and then I head straight to work while my video is uploading. And then I come back home and I go back to sleep and repeat the process. So I haven't been really on YouTube. I just throw a video and tell it, upload at this time, publish on this time. So I'm sorry about that. It's not you guys. It's me personally just trying to balance everything out. We're trying to get healthier with myself and trying to YouTube and try to do my job. And then and I, sometimes I have to, I want to hang out with my friends or even my brother. And it just gets in the way. So I'm going to jump onto that as soon as everything starts cooling down. I, I figured out another way, I, like I said in my video, I wrapped a towel around my neck full of water to keep me cool because right now I am sweating like a beast, like a pig. And I'm sorry about that. So thank you guys. If you guys understand, if you guys um don't harass me about that and if you guys, you know, let it slide for now. I mean, for now, I'm, I'm not going to make this a everyday thing of one video, two videos per day. It's official. I'm stating it right now. <laughs> so until next time guys like and favorite if you enjoyed subscribe like to see some more of me share with your friends and this is your boy Arisen Jados signing out bye bye made it track when I step on the scene I do or die all my life with or without a team fast or slow bro you can't catch me though too fast too furious too hungry for y'all to see I mean what I say and say what I mean I'm the goddamn reason hip hop's back on the street used to put work in the streets now I lay my work on beats and let them work for me yeah so I close my eyes, work and stay on. It's a must. I go from dust till dawn. So I close my eyes, work and stay on. It's a must. I go from dust till dawn.